Welcome to the Nintendo Switch version of Alien Isolation. A survival horror game inspired by Ridley Scott's 1979 masterpiece, Alien. Rooted in the original film's terrifying atmosphere and haunting art direction, Alien Isolation is set 15 years later. You take the role of Amanda Ripley, Ellen Ripley's daughter, I need to find comms. as she strives to unravel the truth behind her mother's mysterious disappearance, while an unidentified predator stalks from the shadows. Amanda is an engineer with the Whaling Jutani Corporation, her mother's old employer. She is informed by the company that the Nostromo's flight recorder has been recovered and is being held on the remote space station, Sevastopol. When offered a position on the recovery team, it is impossible for Amanda to resist the opportunity to understand what happened to her mother. But upon entering Sevastopol, Amanda finds herself faced with a chaotic and horrifying situation. Playing as Amanda, your mission is to navigate the dangerous, decaying station to retrieve the flight recorder. But there is something very wrong. The alien, the ultimate hunter, is on board stalking your every move. It is relentless, reactive, and can track its prey with ease. Survival depends on your ability to improvise and learn. The alien is also learning and will adapt to repeated strategies. Try to be unpredictable, vary your movements, and avoid using the same equipment or hiding places repeatedly. You cannot kill the alien, but you can try to outsmart and evade it. You may even briefly scare it away with flamethrowers or Molotov cocktails. But the alien is not the only threat on Sevastopol. There are surviving crew members prone to panic and aggression as they struggle with the horror that has befallen them. Shit. I need to get into comms control. It's urgent. There's a restricted area. You also have to contend with working Joe synthetics. Rudimentary androids placed on board Sevastopol to assist the crew. Forget it. I'll find my own way in. I wouldn't advise it. But with the ship now in quarantine, their centralized AI is instructing some very unfriendly behaviors. You're becoming hysterical. As you explore the space station, move slowly to avoid attracting attention and stay alert to every sound, from sliding doors to approaching footsteps. Using your wits, the environment, and scavenged materials, you must improvise to survive. Keep your eyes peeled for hiding places, lockers, cabinets, and even tables can provide some cover. But never assume you're safe. If it gets close, the alien can hear you breathe. And while Sevastopol's miles of concealed air vents might seem safe, the alien also uses them, and is much faster than you. When spotted, you need to either fight or run. If you choose to stand your ground, use your weapons wisely. For example, the silent stun button is great for close range, but useless at a distance. And the bolt gun is powerful, but makes a lot of noise. Which may attract some unwelcome attention. You can craft Molotov cocktails and other explosives, as well as medkits for healing, smoke bombs for evasion, and others like noisemakers and flashbangs. Be aware, useful materials are in short supply, and you'll need to search and scavenge. But stay vigilant. Crafting leaves you vulnerable if you spend too much time unaware of your surroundings. Use your motion tracker regularly to determine the direction of nearby threats, but turn it off quickly if it's making too much noise. Rewiring boxes allows you to hack nearby electrical and environmental systems, from cutting off lights to overriding door locks. Now let's look at some of the features unique to the Nintendo Switch version of the game. 
Alien Isolation has been fully optimized for TV, tabletop, and handheld mode. The clips shown here are from playing the game in TV mode. You'll be playing out your mission using classic console controls, and you can also choose to use gyroscopic aim. By tilting your switch or joy-con, you can fine-tune camera movement when aiming weapons, using your motion tracker, or looking around. HD Rumble lets you feel even the slightest sounds and movements, immersing you even further in the danger that surrounds you. Alien Isolation for Switch comes loaded with all seven DLC packs. Across the five survivor mode missions, there are 15 formidable challenges to be completed as quickly as possible. In Crew Expendable and Last Survivor, relive Ellen Ripley's final mission on board the Star Freighter USCSS Nostromo, the setting of Ridley Scott's Alien. The ship is crewed by characters from the film and voiced by the original cast, including Sigourney Weaver as Ellen Ripley. Are you sure you're okay with going in after that thing? Perks of being the captain. So pick up your Nintendo Switch, step aboard Sevastopol, and feel the fear. Anywhere. Anytime. Nowhere is safe.